Hey guys, welcome to CBN News' virtual Holy Land tour, where you get to see the Bible come alive from the comfort of your own home. Today, we're taking you off the beaten path to literally walk where Jesus walked. Julie Stahl takes us down the gospel trail. Take a look. For years, tourists have spent much of their time in the Holy Land, stuck in groups on crowded buses. Now, at certain sites, they can walk paths and trails similar to those taken by Jesus. This new project starts near his boyhood home in Nazareth and ends where he centered his ministry in Capernaum by the Sea of Galilee. And leaving Nazareth, he came and dwelt in Capernaum, which is by the sea in the regions of Zebulon and Naphtali. This is a new, a special project that we think that every Christian should experience. And what we are now trying to do is to give this uh, spiritual uh, special experience to uh, the Christian people. This is Mount Precipice, and behind me is the Jezreel Valley. The Bible says angry crowds tried to push Jesus off the cliff, but he simply walked through their midst and went his way. The first part of the trail is carved into the mountain. The way is uh, very simple. It's not hard for walking, it's not for professional hikers, it's for young people and for uh, old people. Hikers can tackle the entire 37-mile trail or hike a shorter stretch. Parts of it are also made for bicycling. Trail project manager Amir Moran says the symbol of an anchor on a stone pillar marks the route. We see here the next sign um, on the rock there. As you see, we can see it from a long distance, and this is exactly the, the, the way that uh, people uh, thousand years ago signed the ways. It winds by the village of Cana, over an old Roman road, up Mount Arbel, and to the Mount of Beatitudes, where it's believed Jesus preached his Sermon on the Mount. This is exactly the same landscape as it was 2,000 years ago, we chose the route, which is not developed. Almost all the way it looked exactly like uh, in that ancient times. In Capernaum, Jesus' home base, pilgrims can end their trek with a boat ride on the Sea of Galilee, the same water on which Jesus walked. Julie Stahl, CBN News, The Galilee. Thank you so much for joining us today. Be sure to come back here tomorrow to see Mary Magdalene's hometown, Magdala.